Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're opening a portal into the world of Ultima Online Tools and comparing options depending on which server you play, Razor or Razor Enhanced. If you're looking to enhance your UO experience, you've probably come across these names. But what are the key differences and which one should you choose? And I also want to point out that Outlands has a unique fork of Razor that you won't see on other shards. Before we hop into the details, just know you don't need Razor to play the game. The point of these tools is to ease some of the tedious gameplay mechanics, which actually could be considered part of the charm of this old wizard game from 1997. Let's start with the Razor Community Edition. This is often seen as the more classic or original Razer. It's known for its stability and reliability. It has all the core features players have relied on for years, macroing, targeting, hotkeys, and basic automation through macros and scripts. It's generally very lightweight and stable and has a very small footprint. If you're looking for a no frills tool that just works, the Razer community is a solid choice. It's commonly used on shards that wish to preserve the classic feel of Ultima Online. All right, now let's talk about Razor Enhance. This is the more modern and feature rich tool. It builds upon the foundation of Razor, but adds a lot of advanced functionalities. Enhance offers things like advanced targeting, more complex scripting and automation, and a much more customizable interface. It provides an API into the game data that allows you to create gumps and build tools around your UO gameplay. If you want to push the boundaries of automation and customization, especially with Python and C Sharp scripts, Razor Enhanced is the way to go. Since Razor Enhanced is so powerful, it might not be allowed on your shard. All right, that sounds great, Jace, but I actually play it on UO Outlands. What's the difference there? So for those of you on Ultima Online Outlands, there's a unique fork of the Razor Community Edition that's actually tailored for the shard. Uh, this version actually strikes a balance and it retains the stability of the classic Razor, but adds a lot of quality of life improvements and some enhanced targeting and scripting features that are designed specifically for Outlands. While it might have less raw automation power than Razor Enhanced, it's optimized for the Outlands experience. The biggest changes actually relate to finding objects and targeting. You're able to search in specific source containers that you can't do on the regular Razor. Here's a list of the specific Outlands commands if you wanted to learn more. If you are playing on Outlands, this tool is one that comes pre-installed with the client. Unfortunately, you can't use this version of Razor on other shards. So what are the main differences? Well, the Razor Community Edition is it's stable, lightweight, and its classic features are simple. Razor Enhanced is a feature-rich, advanced automation system that's very customizable and has C Sharp and Python scripting. The Outlands Razor is optimized for Outlands. It's stable and has many quality of life improvements. The choice really comes down to your play style, your shard, and your needs. If you want something simple, Razor Community is all you need. If you want some advanced features, Razor Enhanced is the way to go. And if you're on Outlands, you got that pre-installed custom version at your disposal. Hopefully this video helped you understand the differences between these UO tools let me know in the comments which tool you prefer and why, and if you want more info on a specific topic. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more Ultima Online content. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out uoaddicts.com, uorazorscripts.com, and jstones.com. Peace!